sweet and sour sauce is in the building. Yes, yes. All right, so if you're new here, my name is Sweet. Welcome to the channel, I appreciate you stopping in. And for my subscribers, what's up you saucy mother All right, so we are back with some more of the devil than me. If you missed last episode, it's pretty much finna get splizzy on our hotel. Actually, it's already getting splizzy. Things is going crazy. Questions are left unanswered. It's a whole lot, a whole lot of, so let's just get right into it. But before we do, make sure you hit that like button if you haven't already. If you made it this far, it's like part three, four, something like that. Go ahead, show me some love. And if you haven't subscribed, you might as well do that too. I mean, you might as well since you down there, I mean. <sighs> Let's just all take a deep breath and not lose our minds. No, Charles. We're done. This has been weird every step of the way, and now it's getting scary. Oh, yes, relax. sir. I'm serious. Everything about this is off. Kills me to admit it, but Kate is right. She been saying that, though. Somebody tried to attack Aaron. We don't know that's what actually happened. I know what I saw. In the dark. You think I'm making this up? Everyone relax, okay? Just give me a second to think. <laughs> He's trying to make some money. Excuse you. He's trying and to make a exit stage left. Our oh so confident and sure leader. What was that? See, that's not when you go investigate. Uh <laughs> <laughs> He's fast now. Thinking. This looks a lot like a temper tantrum. Maybe he's right. If we don't crush this episode, we're all screwed. Are you kidding me? What? I'm just I've saying. been waiting on you for ages to actually make a decision about something, anything. And now this is when you suddenly choose to take a stand? <laughs> True. <laughs> when this freaking murderer is walking around. Maybe around. I'm crazy, but if Aaron says somebody came for her, I believe her. Period. We're not safe here. It was just a dummy. You think I'm lying? Really? I think maybe you're just confused about what you saw in the dark. I know what I saw. Right. <sighs> Here's the plan. We've already got a plan. It's leaving. Just listen. But they gotta take the ferry back, and we if that ferry not there, conclusions. I'm gonna go and find Dumet and get clear on everything. Everything is gonna be fine. Go okay? find them. And we're gonna get the footage we need. He didn't show for dinner. What makes you think you can find him now? Yeah. A positive attitude. He gonna change the hallways all up try on you. Sometime. You ain't gonna never find. Him. Bravo, Charles. Your delusions make for such great plans. Dumet left. I saw it, remember? Maybe he's back now. Maybe he's not. Would it kill you to think positively just once? Bro, do you see this place, bro? I guess as far as Charlie ideas go, it's not the worst he's ever had. It's not even the worst idea I've had this evening. Don't go patting yourself on the back. I still think your priorities are f mm. Whatever. So now we're gonna play as Charlie. I'm coming with you. Oh, she's Wait. coming with Good, that's good. Do you have to go? Aw. Be right back. Promise. Just stay put so I know where to find you, okay? Yeah, stay with the other people. I don't care what he says. I'm done. I'm getting my <laughs> together. Okay. I'm leaving, Mark. You coming or not? Don't leave Aaron in the room by herself. Aaron saw someone. Okay, you're right. Sorry. It's just Charlie said... We're not safe here. That outweighs having a damn job. You're right. Let's go, Aaron. Everything's gonna be okay. Wait here. Oh my god, they're gonna leave her by herself? Here while I pack up my stuff? I don't want to waste any time. Oh my god, I mean, they're trolling. The Let's all be quick. We'll be right back. I promise. This is so irritating. It's so irritating. No, don't. Are you I'm kidding me? She sorry, literally just, just got attacked. Still freaked out. Can you leave it open so you guys can hear me? Of course. Why don't she just go with them? What they finna go do something in the closet or something? Uh -huh. That's just beyond okay, me. Okay, genius. Where are we going to look first for the mat? I'm not looking for Dumet. I'm scouting for shots. If he pops up along the way, great. Are you kidding me? Jesus. You really don't care about anything else, do you? Of course I care. Tell that to Kate. You know as well as I do, if we're set up and a camera is rolling, she'll want to be in front of it. <sighs> Asshole. Okay. Well, we're, if we're gonna try to find this guy, let's go downstairs. <laughs> Look at that, that hallway closed already. It's like they don't even notice. I'm noticing. I'm playing as them. They're the ones walking around. They should notice that things, the hallways, layouts, and everything is different. Let's see what these numbers are again. Okay, so it's still 0180. Maybe that has something to do with the floor. Oh, what happened here? What happened? I. No idea. 
somebody had a temper tantrum for real. Oh, this is the script. I don't need to look at that. Actually, I can make him look at it. He, I don't think he looked at it yet. I wonder if that groundskeeper would know where the map went. Okay, he has nothing to say. <clears throat> this door. Oh, oh, is that blood? Okay. Jamie, over here. Now this is a clear sign. Clear. Okay. Yeah. I'm freaking the f out. It's just blood. Just? just blood? Are you kidding me? You're jumping to conclusions. Duh! Oh, no, that's what you do when you see blood on the floor. <laughs> and that's not a cause for concern to you? All right, it's a little odd. Odd. What do you want me to say? Look, it's probably just Dumet or the groundskeeper dragging in some dead animal from outside. Yeah, and everything Maybe is towed up. Dinner. It's towed up. The whole freaking lobby is destroyed. Come on, bro. Like, I get they wanted to make the characters make dumb decisions so that they get killed and stuff. But, like, this is too dumb. Too dumb. Welcome, one and all, to tonight's entertainment. Oh, what the f See? Presented by Grantham Dumet. Dumet. What? So he hasn't left. <laughs> That's what you say? They finna kill you as entertainment. He's like, oh, he hasn't left. Head ass. No jogging this time. No jogging this time. This little flashlight, I mean, not flashlight, uh, lighter. I can barely see in front of me. So we just gonna take it slow. Slow and steady wins the race. <laughs> slow and steady. Left to right. Let's go right. Okay, I'm gonna jog. <laughs> What's this? I first met Agent Monday on October 12th, 1997 at O'Hare Airport when I was assigned to welcome him off the plane. I'd actually met him once before at a lecture on criminal behavior given a few weeks prior here in Chicago, but I doubt he remembered me from that. I was pretty nervous as the new kid on the block. I was just out of training and I'd been assigned to drive around this big shot criminal profiler who just cracked the Arkansas case, which was all over the national newspapers. My first impressions were that he was tall. Oh, why did it end so abruptly? Okay. Oh my God, is that a bowler hat on this, this coat rack? It is. Look at that. Look at that. Y'all see that? <laughs> oh, what the heck is you doing over looking at this painting? Intriguing, huh? It's not a freaking art gallery, okay? Ooh, another coin. Actually, I don't even know if I care about these, because the narrator guy didn't even let me spend them. So. And I got 21. What's 9 plus 10? 21! Alright, let's keep going straight. Is she still following? Yeah, she is. She a real one, I give her that. God, is that more blood? Oh my God! Okay, is this door open? Oof. Oh, that's a lovely. Don't touch that. <gasps> What's that noise? Sound like somebody getting murdered. Oh my God! Okay, turn this off. It's distracting. Y'all hear that? Help. You hear that? Help, please help. Please. Help. Trap. Fuck. Trap. Help me. This is set up. Please. 
place. Are you? I'll do anything. What happened? It's like one of them jigsaw okay? things. Will you save him? What the fuck? Oh God. my God. Look. <gasps> what is this? It's a fucking booby trap. You shift your weight off that plate, and this guy is getting run through by that thing. Twisted. like a white guy might not be mr dumet <gasps> he wants him to make him step off the plate oh 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 um okay let's run through my thoughts here i don't know who's under that i don't know who that is do i want to risk dying for that person listen before you say anything Yes, that is selfish. But what would you do? But uh, on the other hand, I kind of want to ego child this guy. I kind of want to stand my ground. I feel like it's a test. But, you know, I might be overthinking it just to get my neck chopped off. So, <laughs> I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay. If he slice me up. <gasps> Woo, traits updated. Uh, okay, I don't know. <laughs> Oh, he stepped off anyway. I guess if somebody sliced my nose, I probably would be freaking freaking out too. Come on, damn it! I feel like that was a. What was that a setup? Was that a real person? Out of here. No. Probably. Charlie. I don't know. Huh? Let's go. Time marches on. Did, did you see him? The mask? What the hell was that? <clears throat> that was a. I I told you so. Are you shitting me? What you thought? We're trapped. Too late. Jesus. We're trapped. What do we do? Break the fucking door down. Right. On three. They need One, to regroup with everybody two, else and three. move as a unit. <clears throat> Literally. That's always the, the mistake everybody makes in movies and games. Scary you know movies that? and scary games. Yes. Splitting up. What is happening? Alright, are we airing now? Oh no, okay. Find your spirit crystal. Don't do that. Why she act scared? They came no, in here together. Me. Sorry, wouldn't want you to cut yourself. The rock is sharp as hell and, you know, super magical. It's an amethyst crystal. It helps keep you calm by blanketing you in protective energy. I know. I remember. If you know, then don't call it a rock. Maybe I just feel like you should take responsibility of your own emotions and stop outsourcing the job to a crystal. Mm. It makes me feel better. Mm. Yeah. It makes me feel better. Something you never seem to be able to do. Mm. Damn. Okay, maybe that was a shitty thing to say. I'm sorry. It's fine. This isn't a time or place to... I have to tell you something. Okay. Earlier, you brought up that DP job I blew off. I never told you the truth about it. About what? It wasn't a job. Not really. What are you talking about? Remember my friend Murray? He was setting up a studio in Brooklyn, Fine Arts. He wanted a partner. <laughs> That's your dream. Yeah. There is exactly zero money to made, so I thought you'd tell me it was insane, rightfully. Because it would be. Why didn't you go for it? Why the hell didn't you go for it? Why didn't you tell me? Things were already starting to get tough for us. Oh, no, no, no. Don't put any of this on me. This is all you. I know. 
I turned it down because it would have taken me away from you. Oh. oh. I, I guess I didn't even think of that. Uh uh. See. I just. Uh, what do you want me to say? Guess I was holding out for things to change with us. Deep down, I'm still hoping. I'm confused. Didn't he break up with her? I was honest about my priorities. You should have said this before. This is basically me choosing whether or not I want to pers- like, I'm interested or not. Nah. Mark, I have never once shied away from telling you where my priorities were. Alright. I get it. We better go. Yeah, Let's ain't nobody got time for that. Get the fuck out of here. Do you think they found Dumet? Terrible Charles time, seems buddy. bent on talking to him, so maybe, yeah. Alright. Does she even pack? Where does okay now we gotta find Aaron, but we're not gonna find her because the hallway's from the shapeshift. Who's going around locking these doors? <laughs> it's a little helper in the yellow coat. Let me see if this is open. Nope. She breathing hard, dang. Wait. Campus Strangler. What's that? Oh no. Is this somebody's idea of a fucking joke? How is this here? Did you bring this? <gasps> That's her! No. Is that her? Yeah. That's her next to the girl. Shelby. Matching nails? God, don't. We always got them done the same. Wow. That's... That's him. What? That's him. The guy in the back. You know him? Of course, of course it is. He Kinda looks did. so out of place. He's just one of those guys that was always around. We would be at some of the same parties, but that's it. It was my fault. You know that's not true. The night it happened, I was supposed to meet her. Wow. We were going to grab some drinks, go to a party. I slept through. There's a big deal on campus not to go out on your own. And Shelby waited for me when I didn't show, and Dang. that's when he, that's when he got her. It's okay. It's not fucking okay. It can't be. I have to live with it every day, and now someone knows. Someone wanted me to find this. <laughs> what the hell is that? I have no idea, but I feel like it's bad. What the hell? Get over here, now! Charlie! I can't hold this. You have to get the fuck out any way you can. Just get the fuck out! Now! Jamie! Charlie! What the hell just happened? I don't know, but I think it's really, really bad. It isn't moving. So now what? We're fucked. That has to be a way around. Yeah, maintenance corridors, crawl space, has to be. At least they got the buddy system. Except Aaron. Look for the others. Flashlight. All right. As long as me and him don't split up, our chances of success are that much better. <gasps> oh, see. Uh. What's going on? Demet, what the hell is going on with him? He was nervous the whole way here. I chalked it up to him just being eccentric. There's a lot of miles between eccentric and murderous. <laughs> is there? Because that was Let's his his gut telling him he's he weird. Saw take off. And he ignored it. So maybe he found out there was a killer and bugged out? Maybe. No. Or perhaps the man we met wasn't actually Dumet. Exactly. And the dude in the mask is? Yep. 
Bearing updated. Jamie and Charlie realized that the man they met wasn't really do met. All right. That contraption, that's a hell of a lot to set up. That was planned out, every bit of it. It was set up yeah. for us to find. Yeah. Which makes it even more likely the dude on the ferry wasn't really the met. Uh-uh-uh. All right, open this. Mother fucker. What, what kind of? Brick wall. Keep going. Just like Holmes. I know. I don't want to think about it. Just like Holmes? I don't get that one. If y'all know what that means, please let me know. Brick wall. Maybe it has something to do with, like, Holmes, his original murder castle or whatever. I'm trying to map this in my head. I think Erin's room has been completely cut off. Jesus, Charlie. Why is he messing with her? Because she's the most easily frightened. The most vulnerable. And y'all kept leaving her alone. Her. That's what these sociopaths do. Where's my dad? Oh, oh my God. I, I cannot. I oh, cannot. Good. You hear a creepy kid voice, too. I was worried I was finally snapping. Mm, Where's let's go. From? God. It's probably fake. It's probably f fake. Maybe. I don't know. What's this way? Another coin? I take that. Charlie, come here. Let's get this open. <clears throat> Yeah, that sounds like an audio recording or something. Oh. Mm -mm. <clears throat> what I told y'all, it's gonna get splizzy. What I say? He's gonna take his time. Y'all got the whole weekend. Mm, that's tough. We're in a bloody nesting doll. What? A Russian nesting doll. You know? A doll in a doll in a doll. Are you losing your shit? Because I don't need that right now. <laughs> We're locked in a kitchen, trapped in a hotel, stranded on an island. Oh. Even if we get out of this room. How do we get out of the hotel? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Or off the island. It's tough. Charlie. I it's going to be a hard, maybe. uh, it's going to be a hard playthrough, well, I feel like, trying to keep everybody this alive. This out. We can probably force it easier than the others. Stand back. Because whatever he wants to happen, he's going to make happen. He has complete control. Like I said. Dang. Charlie? Fuck. Dang, and it closed back? Split up. Now it's finna get ripped. What? That's the word of the day. Split. I know somebody was in there. No, don't put your headphones back. Oh, she finna. She recorded it. I, I, can't, I can't breathe. Relax. Slow, deep breath. In and out. Ah, uh, come on. Yep, yep, footsteps. They gotta hear this. Wait. Yep. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Yup. Again. Guys? Hello? Hey! Charlie? Mark? Jamie? Oh no! 
What if you just literally stay in the room? Like, why do I gotta go in there? What if I just stay in the room? Well, you're probably gonna just gonna come in there and slice you up. I don't know, but come on, come on. Stop being such a damn wimp. But isn't it kind of like um, like if you don't give people what they want, it kind of like stresses them out. Like how people like bullies, they pick on you and expect you to be like, <sighs> but if you stand up for yourself, they like, you're not supposed to do that. You know what I'm trying to say or not really? Because if she just stay in a room, she like is purposely not playing his game. Why is the screen like this? Where's her asthma pump? Did she just take it somewhere? I missed it or something. I don't like this. It's making my eyes water. Treatment for what? Snake oil treatment. Made from the finest king cobra. Silver Ash Institute. There's a backstory to this. I just, I'm, I can't wait to find out what it is. Oh, and then these freaking animatronics, yo. Using real skin, maybe? Question mark. Real bodies. What the hell? Yeah, that's real. That's real. Mm. So maybe he was a mental patient. Don't get too close. That thing gonna stab you in the neck. Don't touch it. Don't. No, I'm not touching that. I'm not touching that. I don't care if I'm missing out on the biggest plot secret of all time. I'm not touching that. <laughs> Barely want to touch this. Tape recorder. Mr. Dumet, I want my team dead. I'll get them to you this weekend. Just do it. Jesus. What? Yes. No. Way! Aaron found evidence that Charlie was complicit in the murders while searching the- What? No way! No wonder why he's like, It's probably fine, he was just dragging an animal. No wonder he was just like, eh, He's probably fine. That's my Charlie impression. Yeah, I need cigarettes. Eh, it's probably fine. Yeah. <laughs> Laurel, who's the Laurel? cutie in that pic you posted? Fuck you, Jamie. Wait, wait. Who, Aaron? Please, my type is badass bitch and not timid woodland creature. <gasps> wow! Hello? Her face always looks lost and confused. Wow! What a tra- Wow. I can't believe this This episode is like the- Oh my god. I don't even know. Like, oh my god. Okay. Wow. And he put her- How did he even get that? Is that her phone in the freaking display case? Yo. This this one out of the whole dark picture series might be the best one. Besides like Until Dawn. Until Dawn was pretty lit. That's Triple H right there. That's the homie. <laughs> Holmes the homie. Ah. <laughs> uh, oh man. Okay, so he's like doing some like I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> a whole carton this time. No you trying to get on my good side or something? Yeah, I'll, uh, I think I'll save it. What, no questions? What's going on with you, Monday? Well, you seem different. Ah! <laughs> I see that glimmer in your eyes. What if Monday is Charlie? Devil. Would that be too extreme? I can keep secrets, man. We all have them. That prosecutor is trying to get numbers out of me. Know that? Of course you know that. 
numbers. They got Holmes for 27, but we know he was closer to 200. Maybe right? that's what that number on the wall Can you imagine is. That? I wish I'd had the time to try and beat that. Sure, they know about those nice realtor ladies. They got families, after all. But the numbers the DA is asking me about? I think he knows there's some people out there, rejects, misfits, the kind of people that when you see them coming, you look the other way. Does anyone notice that mm. they go missing? Mmm, like, like homeless people and stuff. My father always told me to leave my mark on the world. I never knew what he meant by that. Not until I watched that first girl bleed out. Yeah. I call it art. <laughs> That's my signature on society. It's not murder. It's an aesthetic response to what this world has made me. Ask people to list serial killers, and they'll drop five, ten on you before they can think of any more. Ask them to name the detectives that caught those killers. No one is going to say a damn thing. Bro. No one knows. Why does this guy speaking facts? No one cares. No one makes movies about them. Mm. No one puts their faces on t-shirts. Monday gotta be Charlie, bro. Is that too crazy? No one gives a shit. Wow. <laughs> I've left my mark on the world. Have you? Well, um, I don't know if you'll be watching this, but guest 666. Hold on, pause. pause. Um, appreciate that sub. Okay, um, okay. Okay. <laughs> Dear Mr. Thompson, why don't you leave me the hell alone? Dear, dear Miss Monday, I've tried to contact you by telephone for a number of weeks regarding your son's recent behavior in school. Hector... Hector has been, why all the H's? He's been lashing out frequently at other children in an aggressive and threatening manner. During gym class, his teacher noticed he had come to school with severe bruising on his legs. I'm concerned about his welfare, please con contact me at your earliest convenience. So, Miss Monday, meaning the wife of the detective Monday, I don't know what the detective's first name is, but his son is lashing out, being aggressive, and probably getting beat on at the crib possible so monday is something something's going on with that detective aaron hello jamie Ooh. fuck you jamie no that's not her set up aaron you there uh hello can you hear me what is happening what you're not safe aaron how are you have to listen to me do exactly as I say. If this is a recording, this makes it even more messed up. I'm not gonna accuse her yet. Yeah. Jamie, what is going on? Where are you? I don't. Just listen. Listen. There's a cupboard in How there. How is that panicky to want to know? What are you talking about? Just hide, Aaron. How does she Why know that? Why are you telling me this? What's happening? Aaron, now. Just trust me, okay? Hi then, Shreddy. Did she say go in there, right? Hide. Hide. She a snake, but I, I trust her. Maybe that's a mistake, I don't know. But... Maybe that is Mr. Dumet. With his light skin ass. <laughs> Stop making noises. Am I finna get got? I don't know, I can't tell. They're not really showing his skin color that much. Okay, no, that's not Mr. Dumet. Oh my god. Oh 
Oh no. Oh no. Aaron, I'm sorry. I was rooting for you, but uh it's not looking too good. Damn. Trolley? Jamie? Hello? Where the hell are they? Hopefully somewhere safe, wondering where the hell we are. <clears throat> Kate, check this out. What is going on? <clears throat> are, are we locked in here? Looks like it, yeah. Wait. Shh. What? Shh. You hear that? Is that them? Where's it coming from? Somebody's in the restaurant. Oh, this is from that dinner conversation. I know that I'm the butt of your jokes, and that's just my cross to bear as the patriarch of our little family. This guy been doing a lot of work behind the scenes. <laughs> wow. And Kate, despite our bickering, you are the heart of this show. You keep people interested. What the fuck is this? Mark, what are you doing? Just stay back from it. There are only mannequins. What has Charlie gotten us into? Yeah, what, what? This is beyond messed up. Yeah. I don't know what Charlie's gotten us into, but if I see Dumet, I'm gonna fuck him up. Period. Oh man, we're playing as a... Uh... <laughs> What's this guy's name? I forgot already. All right, I think I'm gonna stop it there. You know? It sucks, I know. It's getting real juicy, but... It's beyond me. It's been it's been like 40 minutes, so. So yeah, that's a wrap for now. Stay tuned for the next part. Try to get out as fast as I can. Until then, I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.